My eyes used to glow like embers, but now witch drains my hoots and cats purrs until we are hoarse. They are the oil that fires up her magic. Cat doesn't mind as much as I do. She sleeps most of the day anyway. I used to rule the night. Witch whispered spells so I could grow wings wide as clouds and soar to the moon, taste the salt of the stars, hear the song of other owls across planets. I brought back dragonflies, black lilies that only flowered once a year, mermaid buckthorn, wolf butterflies. Now she has forgotten that we are wild creatures. She locks us in. Cat is pathetically domestic, sitting on witch's lap. But I am not made to live under a roof. Gretel understands. Witch trusts her with the keys to everything, except Hansel's cage. She opens the bars of the window at night so I can sneak out and hunt. Witch was a seamstress in a past life. She could mend anything except her own face and spine, deformed by a cruel husband. She stitched Gretel's new shirt and cloak, and used the flea-ridden rags clinging to her bony frame in her spells. The sort of magic the witch does now needs misery. I suppose even Gretel could turn out like witch if she stays here long enough. She's almost an apprentice, carefully cutting and measuring, sweeping and following every gesture as carefully as I stalk rodents. She needs to find a vulnerability to free Hansel. If witch cooks Hansel, we'll be all that's left. After all, Gretel's parents sent her to the woods to be devoured by beasts. This whole unpleasant thing with baking children started slowly we're sure it was the books the villagers brought in payment for her cures. Which gave them sweets and potions that remedied broken hearts or rickets or insomnia. They brought eggs or potatoes, or sometimes odd things like a virgin's hair and a sorcery book found buried under a headstone. It smelt of rot and ancient death, but which couldn't resist opening it trying more complex spells. That is how she found the recipe for a house made of sweets and chocolate that doesn't melt in the sun or get eaten by ants. She bottled the spit of spiteful husbands. She took sunless days and put them in a jar. She created a museum of the half-dead prey I and Cat brought to her, and she would not let us kill it. Then she started to see things differently. A boy came on an errand and she took out her gun. She thought he was a wolf. It is only the men which sees as animals. She sees girls just as they are. Now Hansel is kept in a cage and stuffed full of sweets and cakes. And witch sees a hog ready for roasting. She thinks Gretel is hallucinating when she claims the hog is her brother. The boy does eat and snort a lot, and his skin is pinkish. Perhaps humans are similar to pigs, but it's wrong to eat your own species. <laughs>